Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to supercharge your content efforts using AI. Now, this is gonna require you to have a YouTube video that you can paste as a link and it's going to transcribe that video and take it and put it into conversational format. And we're going to use a tool called Splash Dash that has access to YouTube's API to do this. So to get started, there's so many things that you can do with this. Um, probably the first and up most important is you can have it create blogs and articles based on YouTube videos. You can have it create social media post ideas. You can have it create blog article topics. You can have it do basically anything. So if I were an agency doing what we do today, this is a, an effort that I would do probably on a monthly or weekly basis for our clients to provide them with recommendations on what to add to their website, what to add to their social pages, what to run as digital ads. And really the world is endless here because this is utilizing ChatGPT, the newest, latest model with the power of Splashdash, which is connected to all of these different integrations. So Let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and you should see our splash dash pulled up here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this for a client and that client is a dental office that we've been working for quite some time now. Um, he has just been featured on an amazing podcast where he talked about uh, biological dentistry, which is a new form of dentistry where the dentist is really focusing in on your holistic health. And on this podcast, he talked to a pretty big influencer. And so traditionally, I could listen to the podcast, take notes, and write the information, or I can copy the transcript and put it into ChatGPT4 and then get content recommendations that way. For me, that's just not that effective. I'd rather do it all within a conversational format and get the results quicker. So I'm going to open up Splashdash. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to type in the SERP API. And the SERP API is going to allow me to gather a ton of different things that I can get from Google, Bing, DuckDuckGo, and YouTube. So for this specific case study or scenario, I'm going to type in summarize this video's transcript. The video that I'm summarizing is publicly listed on YouTube, which is really important. I'm not saying that you should go and gather competitor videos and make it content out of it. If you, if you want, you can do that. Um, but in this case scenario, I'm going to use our client's actual video, which was a really, really good interview that he did here. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the paste button. And now what Splashdash is going to do is it's going to talk to the SERP API. And really what that's going to do is it's going to take the video ID and it's going to get that information very clearly here. And I'm going to go ahead and confirm. And so now what it's going to do is it's going to summarize that video in conversational format, really taking the most important parts of that video that were there and then putting it into this really nice list that I can use for content creation. Now, the cool part about this is you can do multiple videos at a time. You can do competitor videos. You can do videos about a specific topic. And really, you can get a ton of information about all of the different videos that are out there by just pasting in a link to this actual uh, uh, tool. So now that I have a lot of this information actually coming in here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and find another video about biological dentistry. And I'm going to use YouTube to find this video. And the first one I'm going to pick is this one here. It's about a minute and 22 seconds long. And now heading in Splashdash, I can now do the same thing by just pasting the video link because it already has the context of what I was doing. And it's going to run the same action, except this time it's going to run it for the separate video ID that was listed there. And so from there, I can click on confirm. And now it's going to do the same process where it's going to highlight the doctor. It's going to explain everything that the doctor was talking about in that video. And then it's going to give me a ton of the different points that he discussed inside of that. And if they both have the same design or practice philosophy here, um, practice philosophy around this type of dentistry, you should see similarities in what they're talking about. But because the video above was a longer video, there's more content and context that was summarized. So now that I have both of these summaries, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the context of this prompt and have Splashdash create, let's say, blog topic ideas. So now my prompt would basically be to use the information above, write five blog topic ideas, show me how you came up with the ideas based on the video. I really want the AI to understand that I'm looking for specific reasons as to why it recommended them based on the videos above. So now what I'm going to get is I'm going to get some topic ideas based on what the doctors actually mentioned on the videos. So the first one is the mind body spirit connection. And the reason why I picked this is because it chose the second principle outlined by Dr. Uh, Kira Loda. I don't know how to say that. 
Then it's beyond the drill, how biological dentistry is redefining dental care. And this one actually took it away from the minimally invasive dentistry. Then it talks about mercury free, which is a big part of the video that was mentioned above. And then it was integrating wellness and not just thinking about dentistry specifically. So that's going to put that there. And then the environmental impact of your dental care, um, literally talking about how uh, a lot of these dental materials are not good for the environment. And so biological dentistry is becoming uh, more popular in this case scenario. So that's kind of how you can start to prompt different content ideas based on the videos that are mentioned above. So of course, if I wanted to continue the conversation, I can now ask it to create social posts. I can now ask it to create quotes from the video. I can now ask it to do anything based on the video URL by just simply pasting that URL down below. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I really quickly wanted to show you how you can generate endless ideas of content, whether they're video scripts, blog posts, social media graphics, et cetera, just by leveraging artificial intelligence, specifically Splashdash that has access to a lot of these different API calls. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.